Hey guys, this is Tony with uh, CSPN. Uh, we got our new DMA stock in. It is on the shelf ready for purchase. So, we're going to take a look at how to install and what it looks like on all the various platforms like our 468 uh, Milsig, Scarab Arms, and the Tiberius D15. So, here we got my DMR. Um, I am moving from my old SCA stock to this. This is way more solid, uh, especially if you're in a, in a sitting position or a prone position. Um, got a lot more solid shouldering to it. Uh, no wobble in it, which is really nice. Um, the old SCA stocks, they, they were loose enough so you could slide them back and forth real good for a carbine. Um, for this, it's real good for a marksman roll, um, where you're not moving around as much. Uh, so we're going to go over the uh, installation, um, real easy. Uh, the nice thing about these is on the lever, uh, when you pull the lever on all the way, uh, the pin on the inside uh, where the guide rail goes collapses all the way. So you can just nice and easy, just like that. All right, so here we got the installation, um, real easy. Nice and simple. And goes back on just the same. Uh, almost exactly like the SCA stocks and the TCA stocks. That's fully extended. Collapses all the way in. Uh, the nice thing about these is on the, the internal side, when you depress the lever, the internal pin goes all the way down. So you don't have to mess with uh, going over the back end of the guide reel. Uh, makes it really easy for everybody. So this is a Milsig Paradigm. Um, on these especially, um, almost all of the Milsig platform, one thing to consider when you're working on putting on a DMA stock on these platforms is the space in the guide rail between the tank and the guide rail here and in the back is slightly bigger. So getting the guide rail on isn't as easy as on our platforms. So it takes a little bit of gentle love tapping, you know, getting it in there to get it to seat fully. And once you're there, golden. All right, I want to add that uh, depending on the tank diameter, um, some tank manufacturers are different. Uh, Ninjas usually run small, um, so any tank you get through us is going to be a small diameter. If it's a larger tank, the guide rail is going to be pushed out further, so it's going to be a little more on that lever to get the pin to go over the end of the guide rail. The trick I used is to get one of the binder clips, you know, just like from school, and pull on the pin here to get it to go past the back of the guide rail. So, if you are looking for the same feel as a TCA stock with a DMR look and feel to it on the shoulder, this is definitely the way to go. Um, we will put a link in the description below. Uh, check that out on the website. Uh, as always, like and subscribe if you enjoy the video. Um, if you haven't already, check out Enmore, um, kind of uh, October. Uh, I'm super excited for that. And... Go to